what is happening guys welcome to Anne's Bodybuilding and Fitness a very tired look at me um, it is Saturday and time for the reverse diet another full day of eating today macros we're hitting proteins 180 carbs 300 fats 60 so actually lower the protein slightly um, I thought with not being in prep um, going to get the protein gradually down to 1 gram of one gram per pound of body weight, or just a bit above actually. And yes, carbs are going up, they'll be going up quite a lot, but um, on a kind of fortnightly basis. And yes, let's take into the kitchen, show you the first meal. Right guys, as you know, it's the usual to begin with. Multivitamin, four fish oil, vitamin D, and five grams creatine. Right, moving on, thought I'd try something different. 30 grams of Purina One adult cat food. Oh yeah, not serious. We are we're looking after you today, aren't we? You hungry? Hungry? Yeah. All right, let's give you a food. I wonder how many calories are in this. Someone's hungry. Right, onto my actual food. Okay, so back to my calories. Um, yeah, I'm actually increasing my calories while that's 600. Let's flip it around. 600 calories over the lowest, um, lowest post comp calories, pre comp calories, um, just to give them a nice initial bump, get them near maintenance, and then we're gradually going to increase. Right, so first meal 100 grams of oats in here, 350 grams of water today. I usually have unsweetened almond milk, but we've run out. My own fault, very annoying. Um, so I'm going to micro this, and then I'm going to add some protein. Right guys, we're going to add 30 grams beef protein, here are the macros per serving, a bit of cinnamon on top, and as we're not using milk today, 60 grams of Philadelphia extract, just sort of added creaminess. Alright, just mix this up. Okay, and there we have it, the finished product, cinnamon and banana fudge oats, very tasty this one. Alright, here are the macros for this meal, this will keep me going for about 4-5 to five hours, see you guys, meal number 2. And welcome back. It is half eleven. I'm about to have meal number two. Why are you talking about that? It's my voice now. Hello. Um, babe, why don't you show the viewers what you've done to my no. my jumper? No. So, Sarah's washed one of my clothes. Why don't you hold it up? No. Why don't you show... Look on. How's my jumper looking, babe? It looks like a jumper. Does it? Should we have a look? Hold it up. Hold it up for reference. So am I really going to fit into that jumper? Yes. <laughs> Prep Anthony will fit yeah. into that jumper. That wouldn't even... F that is like a four-year-old. Four-year-old's Chloe. Might give it to my little nephew. Got another visitor today. Say hello, Missy. Anyway, so... Meal number two. Um, probably going to keep the macros quite low for this one so we can... In case me and Sarah want to enjoy a nice meal out later on, um, or me and one of the two. So, not too sure what I'm going to have. Let's go to the kitchen, sort my hair out, and make some food. Okay, so I've decided what to have. We're going to have a half pack of chicken tikka. I always have this stuff. Uh, a nice big portion of courgettes, these are frozen, um, with half an onion and some beans. Going to fry that all together, throw in the chicken at the end. Not too sure how this is going to turn out. But we will see. Okay, let's have a look at meal number two. Looks okay. Never tried this, so we'll see what it will taste like. Um, so we have 120 grams chicken tikka and a onion, half an onion, a big portion, 500 grams courgette, half a portion of low salt beans. Here are the macros for this meal. I'll let you know what it's like after, but uh, yeah, there you go. See you guys, meal number three. How you doing, babe? Doing my washing. Welcome back, guys. Sarah's doing her job. Not serious. I'm not one of those guys. Right. <laughs> okay, so uh, how was my last meal? It was nice, thank you. Uh, and yeah. Just ask yourself a question and answer it. Yeah, no, because I wanted to say the last meal. Uh, how was So, what did I have? I've forgotten, it was so long ago. But it came out pretty well. Um, anyway, on to this meal. It's currently half four. I'm very hungry. Uh, still keeping the calories quite low, so me and Sarah can enjoy a nice meal tonight. We're going to make a bowl cake with 
I'll show you guys how I make this. We use one and a half servings of pure whey protein, a little bit of vita fiber powder, making it in liquid or powder form, 15 grams of this. I'm going to throw in 10 grams of cocoa, a little bit of milk, mix all together, and see what happens. I might have thrown in some, I think I've got some more teasers left as well. Where are they? Yeah, yeah I might have thrown in some of those too. So, chocolate protein cake. So, we mix this together, microwave it, and see what happens. Oh, one other ingredient we need some baking powder also. So. Mix, mix, mixing. Oh, yeah, thanks, your video. Uh, yeah, mix them all together. And we're going to throw in some Maltesers. Where are they? You be eating them. I'm eating Maltesers. You eat my Maltesers. No. I'll be very angry. What would you do? Check out this. Mixing the bowl cake up. How's that look, babe? I don't want to tell you what it looks like. Let's see what it looks like so far. Not quite cake like yet, but you see, it's got some nice volume. 20 more seconds. Okay guys, bowl cake is done. Check it out. And this is a big bowl as well, so you've got some nice volume there. Um, and yeah, the Maltese bowl cake. Not too sure how they're going to be. I'm going to leave this to harden up for a couple of minutes. And here are the macros of this meal. Check out the cake. Oh yeah. A Maltese bit there. Ah. Hmm? Look at that. Mm. Welcome back. You attacking the cat? Yeah. Okay guys, so final meal of the day. I left myself a lot of carbs for this one. 170 grams of carbs to eat. Because we wanted a takeaway. And we have, well I have, a Thai curry, not Thai curry, a Thai ginger. Thai chicken ginger. It was very nice, I haven't tried this one yet. I have half a portion of rice. I might have the whole lot. Some prawn crackers. And I'm going to have a few glasses of red wine. Two to three glasses. Now obviously... And hello baby, what have you got there? A yellow curry? Oh yeah. One random tomato. Um, so, this is probably like the fourth or fifth time I've drank alcohol this year, but yeah, gotta be flexible. One can fit anything into a flexible diet. Um, and yeah, we're gonna be guesstimating the calories slightly on this. Try and be as accurate as I can, but um, yeah, loosely tracking macros. Here are the macros below that I feel will be eaten during this meal, um, including the two glasses of wine. And yeah, there you have it, flexible dieting, how to do it properly, in my opinion. Um, so I'm going to enjoy this lovely meal now with my wife, is it nice? Mm. <laughs> and yeah, that is all guys. Um, here are the total day macros that I've hit today in this reverse diet. So these will be going up on a weekly to fortnightly basis. Um, yeah, that is all guys. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.